what's up guys big d wiz here old school stereo.com so what do we got here today we've got a set of custom diy by big d wiz rockford fosgate audiophile bookshelf speakers now these are car audio speakers a four inch and a soft dome tweeter in some old school surround sound enclosures these are metal surround sound enclosures by a company called universal but i've got sort of a build log that i'm going to show you i'm going to show you that first and then i'm going to give you a demo so enjoy the build and demo coming up soon <music> Alright guys, just wanted to give a quick update about the um, old school boombox. These are the speaker enclosures I've decided to use. And these are from an old home theater in a box. I don't know, probably 20 years ago when they first started coming out. Very cheap speakers in here. And as you can see, it's got a four inch. And there's no tweeter hole there. So what I had to do was cut out the opening for the tweeter. And luckily the four inch hole is exactly perfect for the audiophile four. You can see the flush mount is going to fit in there. And what I'm going to do is I've already sanded these down a little bit. You might notice it's a little rough. I'm going to paint it black so it looks nice. And since these enclosures are metal, what I've done is I've coated the inside with um, Dynamat style material sound editing material if you will and you can see it's already got wires connected I'm gonna desolder these and put a little bit larger maybe 16 gauge wire and I'll get rid of the logo and I may sand the outside and repaint these as well <clears throat> and put a Rockford logo on there instead of the Universal because I'm sure if I leave that on there Universal Records will probably tag this video knowing them so anyway that's just a quick update um, it's taken longer than I anticipated but that's how DIY projects work. So more coming soon.
so I hope you enjoyed the demo. I'll talk a little bit more about the setup here. These are Rockford Fosgate audio file RFA414 components, which is a four inch mid-range and a, I believe it's a one inch or one and a half inch soft dome tweeter. These are from approximately 1995 and they were Rockford's high end uh, audio file setup. And I'll show you what I did here with the with the speaker grill. I got some of these stick on emblems from Rockford that you can get on their website. And I put a little emblem there on the grill. And you can see the other one is already, the grill is already mounted. So looks really clean. These bookshelves are very small. They're only about seven inches tall by about five inches wide by about five inches deep. So really small setup, not a whole lot of kick. Um, I guess not to be expected with a four inch. These are designed for maybe 150 Hertz and higher, not anything lower. So adding a subwoofer is a necessity, which I will do soon. But I just wanted you guys to check out my DIY project. You guys can do something like this yourself. Take some of your old car stereo equipment and, you know, just mod it. Make a cool little project. So anyway, that's Big D Wiz. I'm out of here. We'll see you.